Big breaking story this evening. Lieutenant General Rath has been found guilty in the Sukna land deal. That's the big news coming in. He's been found guilty on three counts at a court martial. Lieutenant General P.K. Rath is the first serving Lieutenant General in history to be court martialed in this fashion. Lieutenant General Rath accused of wrongfully guaranteeing, granting uh, no objection certificates and MOUs to a private real estate developer. And, uh, and Lieutenant General Rath uh, was. Uh, head of the 33 core when he was, he granted uh, these uh, no objection certificates and signed that memorandum of understanding he was indicted earlier by a court of inquiry let's go across to anubha bhosle who's been covering this story anubha unprecedented never before correct me if i'm wrong has an army in this fashion court martialed a senior officer Yes, he's the first serving Lieutenant General in the history of the Indian Army uh, to face general court martial proceedings and now to be convicted by a GCM in Shillong. Uh, this particular conviction news has ju come just a couple of minutes ago. We do believe the quantum of sentence could either be pronounced tomorrow or perhaps even on Sunday. Uh, Venkatesh, the general court martial has been hearing this case for the last many months. It has caused Lieutenant General P.K. Rudd to come before it. It has also produced uh, many other civilians, many other armed forces, as well as the judge advocate general to come forward and put what the army believes should be done in this case uh, of uh, impropriety of land scam of 70 acres of land that was uh, wrongfully given a no objection certificate and an MOU for a private real estate developer Dilip Agarwal to build up an educational institute here. Right Anubha he's been convicted on three counts I'll ask you in a moment to take us through these counts but what's the worst that uh, he can be sentenced? Uh, Venkatesh, it could be an entire spectrum that the general court martial uh, could look at. Uh, the worst case scenario, first, it could be uh, he could be court martialed uh, uh, from he could be dismissed from the service, which means that there would be a loss of rank completely. Uh, there would be a huge financial implication. There would be no pension coming in for Lieutenant General P K Rat. Um, if uh, the seven Lieutenant Generals do believe that uh, they look into several cases of about three decades of service, uh, a past record which doesn't have any major taint, they could perhaps give him a loss of service uh, this would mean or a loss of seniority this would mean that he perhaps whenever he retires uh, he would uh, retire with a lower rank he would retire with some less financial benefit but yes the worst case scenario could be a dismissal from service which is when we would say that the general court martial uh, has indeed court martialed Lieutenant General P.K. Rath.